Hey there Pisces, welcome to Cards and Clarity Tarot and thank you so much for being here. This is going to be your general weekly reading for January the 13th through the 19th. Um, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns regarding time frames, energies, things of that nature, all of that stuff should be addressed within the description box down below, as well as my information if you would like to donate to my channel or contact me regarding a personal reading. So Pisces, your energy feels more fiery to me than anything. Um, it feels almost combative. I was hearing give them what they asked for. So, um... Yeah, I was getting that very strongly, so I feel like that'll come out in the cards, but I was also getting, I feel like you're branching out, okay? I feel like you're uh, networking with people of the same profession. Um, I feel like you're dating. I, feel, I just feel like you're socializing in general, Pisces, okay? You're getting yourself out there. I'm hearing six months. Six months, okay? Six figures. Wow, Pisces. Let's see here what we get. You put your money where your mouth is. Let's see what this is, Pisces. Yeah. See, socializing, okay? Um, there's some other stuff out here, too, so let's get it out. Put these cards to the side here. Yeah. Let's see. This could be in regards to love as well. Um, could be with a Gemini, Aquarius. Let's see here. Or Libra. Okay, we've got all those out here. Um... So, Pisces. Uh. Oh, okay. Um, I feel like you're reflecting on something here, okay? I feel like for some of you, this is a work situation as well. I definitely feel like... Pisces. Okay, I feel like there's more work that needs to be put in on something, okay? Yeah, I feel like more work needs to take place here. Mercury and Sagittarius, I feel like there's something you need to step on here and take action on in order to get to that Ten of Pentacles, okay? And I, because... Three of, three of pentacles to me. This is Capricorn energy. Um, but, you know, these pentacles are not yet yellow. I just feel like it's some it's a card of, like, working and not getting results yet, okay? And I feel like that's because you're not very focused, okay? I feel like you're um, not very focused. You're not putting as much into this as you could. Libra energy here with this card. But you're not putting as much into it, so you're not getting, you know, what you're putting into it is all you're getting out of it, okay? But I do feel like this is your destiny. This is your calling. This is something you're going to be recognized for. Six of Wands and the Star card showing up here, all right? But I just feel like more needs to be put into that, all right, for a lot of you, okay? So um, the Lover's card showing out here, and the Two of Cups is coming out as well. Like I said, I feel like for a lot of you Pisces, um, you know, I feel like you're talking to someone of the same profession. I feel like you're networking, all right? Okay, that's what I feel like saying here. For some of you, though, I feel like you're choosing someone this week, or someone's choosing you, all right? But I feel like you're dating, Okay. See the Lover's card coming out here as well. I feel like you're looking at your options here and you're choosing one, okay? Or this is somebody else choosing you, Pisces. Um, but Ten of Cups, somebody could be traveling this week as well. Um, somebody's communicating with you, Pisces. Somebody's opening up emotionally is what I feel like saying here. Yeah. Let's see here. Two of Wands, okay? A choice. Somebody's taking action on something. Two of Cups, Two of Wands. There's a choice being made here this week, Pisces. Somebody's reflecting on something. All right. We got a Ten of Cups out here in Empress. Yeah, you're very attractive to somebody here, Pisces. I'm going to look at the Fool card because the Fool card is out here too. Aquarian energy. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Let's look at the Fool here. Tell me about the Fool. Tell me about the Fool, please. Yeah, it's about a choice here, okay? It's about a choice. Um, could be in regards to a fire sign or um, a Libra, but it doesn't have to be. Um, somebody's making a choice here, okay? Somebody's taking a leap of faith with this card uh, showing up here. Mercury and Aquarius. Somebody could be traveling to deliver you news about something as well, or you could be traveling to deliver somebody else news, okay? Okay. <clears throat> I feel like it's something to do with your happiness here, Pisces. This Ten of Cups. All right, I don't feel like it's bad news, okay? 
the Empress. This is, yeah, Pisces, I feel like you're dating too, okay? With that Three of Cups, I've already said this. I feel like you're dating. I feel like you're trying to choose someone here, okay? Uh, because this is Venus, all right? Venus um, is exalted in Pisces, and I'm pretty sure Venus went into Pisces today, all right? So it's a good time to date. I'm pretty sure that Venus is in Pisces until like February the 7th or something like that. Um, but I definitely feel like you're headed after emotional fulfillment here. You're headed after your Ten of Cups, okay? But there's something about, there's a choice that needs to be made here, okay? Yeah. Let's see. For some of you, somebody's letting down their guard within a situation here as well. Somebody's letting down their guard, all right? I think it's this King of Wands here, okay? Could be a Leo, Scorpio, fire, another fire sign. Um... Yeah, but somebody's not let go of something here. Somebody wants to put in the work on something. Capricorn and Virgo energy here with these two cards, all right? Mm. Pisces, I'm getting the vibe here that somebody was feeling entitled to your energy here. They expected to find you where they left you here with this card, um, is what I feel like saying. Um, with these three cards, excuse me. Five, five of swords, seven of swords, and nine of cups. All right, all... Two... Or, shit... <laughs> five of swords and seven of swords. I feel like there's unequal give and take within this situation, all right? Um, it feels like past energy to me coming back around here. Yeah, you're giving them what they wished for, okay? This person could have, yeah, this person could have wanted to see other people as well, is what I feel like saying. Pisces, let's see what this is about. Tell me about the nine of cups. Tell me about the nine of cups, please. Tell me about the nine of cups. Yeah, Queen of Cups. I feel like, see, I feel like you've closed off emotionally to this person. Cancerian energy, okay? Yeah, Pisces, because I feel like you were giving them all this energy, all this attention, all this time, um, and things of that nature, and I feel like you released that, okay? I feel like they're no, yeah, I feel like Pisces. I feel like you were committed to this person without the label, without the commitment, is what I feel like saying here. Could have been a Taurus, doesn't have to be, and now they have competition, all right? Because that's what they wanted, okay? They didn't want to be in a connection with you, in a commitment with you, whatever the case may be. So you moved on to something else. Could have been a Scorpio, uh, but there was definitely an ending and a new beginning came about from that ending, all right? So you could have moved on to someone else here, Pisces, is what I feel like saying. Yeah, because us Pisces, we tend to do this, okay? Uh, Queen of Wands, she can be, um, you know, she's very nurturing and giving, but I feel like she's also, um, you know, the, the queen that kind of chases. She kind of suffocates things, controls things. Um, I'm not saying that you were suffocating or controlling, but that's how this person could have felt, um, with, it, with all this energy coming at them, all right? Because us Pisces, we're, we are very over-nurturing, okay? So um, I feel like this person could have, um, you know, shut down to that is what I feel like saying here. Put up a guard towards you, ignored you, things of that nature. Um, all right. And I feel like you left them alone, okay? You, you gave them what they wanted here. Let's see. Tell me more about this. You could have moved on to a Cancer here. This could have been a Cancer you moved on from. Cancer could be stuck on you as well or another Pisces. But that's what I'm feeling here. Somebody's stuck on you after you move forward, okay? After you've moved on with someone else here, Pisces. Let's see what else we get here. Any other messages for Pisces? Any other messages for Pisces? Any other messages for Pisces? Yeah, they're feeling burdened by this, okay? They're feeling burdened by this Sagittarian energy with that Ten of Wands. I feel like this could be an Aries as well. Yeah, it's, not, it's definitely something that ended, okay? They're looking back on this situation. This could have been a third-party situation for some of you with an Aries, okay? Um... Yeah, I feel like this person, this King of Wands, let me find it here. See, I feel like they're reflecting on uh, the choices they made here, on what they decided to give to, what they made a priority here in this situation. Taurian energy, also Libra with this card, um, and more Libra energy here with this um, Three of Swords, okay? Pisces, for some of you, I feel like you're manifesting money right now as well. But you're looking really attractive to this person. Whoever this is.
What's that popping out there? Five of Pentacles, yeah. They're feeling lonely, okay? Taurian energy with this card. Yeah. I can't help but feel, yeah. Yeah, they're watching you as well. Air energy, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Yeah, I feel like they're going to be making an offer here, but I don't feel, I feel like you have other options here, okay? Yeah, you definitely have other options. Could be a Leo or a Virgo you've moved on to here, Pisces. Or from. Anything else for Pisces. Anything else for Pisces here within this situation. Or for this week. Anything else for Pisces. Pisces, they didn't expect this, okay? They didn't expect this at all, okay? Gemini energy, they didn't think you had it in you. Okay, they didn't think you had it in you to go out and date, to go, to actually genuinely leave them alone. Uh, because I feel like they told you that in a way. I don't feel like they really told you that um, verbally. But, um, you know, through their actions, they told you that they, did, that they did, not, did not want to deal with you, Pisces, is what I feel like saying here. So you moved on to other things. And now this person wants to come back around and give you the attention that you were giving them. And I don't feel like you're very open to that, okay? I feel like you've moved on to something else here. Or something else is coming in at the same time, Pisces. I feel like something else is coming in at the same time here too, okay? Yeah. Let's see. Clarify the Eight of Swords. Let's see. Eight of Swords is coming out in reverse, all right? Yeah, you freed yourself from this person, okay? I feel like they're feeling that too. Yeah, they, I thought like they are going to make you an offer, but you're not going to be up for it, okay? You've got other options here. These three cups down here, like I said, three of cups. I feel like you're dating, Pisces. I feel like you're dating other people here, okay? Some of you are just working on money, manifesting money. Yeah, okay. Some of you are just working on yourself as well. Okay, Six of Cups is coming out too. Uh, Scorpionic energy, okay? I feel like this is talking a lot about experience too, Pisces. Yeah, I'm hearing six months again. So, yeah, okay. I feel like you're going to gain some experience here uh, that's going to get you recognition, okay? Or you have experience that's going to get you recognition here soon. But I just feel like there's some work that needs to be put in here to get to this Ten of Pentacles though, okay? But I feel like it's coming. There's just something that you, you, need, you need to put all of your focus into something here, Pisces, is what I feel like saying. Yeah, that's what I feel like saying here. Oh, I already fell out. No, just kidding. We were already out. Let's see what else we're getting here for Pisces. Anything else for Pisces? Yeah, I feel like there's abundance coming in here, okay? Um, but I feel like you're taking your time on something, growing something here, Pisces. Um, Sagittarius energy. Maybe you're taking a little bit too much time. I'm hearing borrowed time. You're doing something for longer than, um, yeah, you're dragging something out for longer than expected, longer than you should have. Um, yeah, that's what I feel like, feeling like saying here. Or somebody else is dragging something out for longer than expected. Let's see here. Okay, we've got a king and queen of swords. Yeah, okay. Pisces. I feel like there's a conversation coming with someone this week. Libra or an Aquarius, possibly. Um, yeah. Okay. I feel like you could be walking away from someone this week who's taking too long uh, to make a decision on something here with this Eight of Cups showing up. Piscean energy. All right. Anything else for Pisces? Anything else for Pisces? These cards are almost... Yeah, I've got like seven cards left. There's not enough left here to shuffle. Let's see. Anything else for Pisces? Knight of Cups could be another Pisces coming in this week as well. Something's coming in here this week, Pisces. I think that it's more than one thing coming in as well, is what I feel like saying too with this showing up as well. I definitely feel like a lot of things are coming in at once, Pisces. That could be what the Seven of Cups is about as well. But I definitely feel like you have options in regards to jobs, um, ideas, people, uh, things of that nature, okay? don't yeah don't don't attach yourself to one thing or one idea okay is what i feel like saying with this devil card showing out here capricorn energy yeah i feel like you need to focus on one thing and that's what's going to bring you into balance here into wish fulfillment into whatever it is that you're looking for here pisces because i definitely feel like you're on you're, you're searching for something here okay something yeah your ten of pentacles your ten of cups you're searching for something okay you're wrapping things up too we had the ten of swords out here we had the uh ten of wands as well so 
all of those symbolize completion. So I definitely feel like you're uh, closing out toxic shit and you're headed to better things. Okay, so that's what I feel like saying here to you this week, Pisces. There are just some decisions that need to be made and uh, you need to kind of, um, you know, get some tunnel vision about in regards to a certain situation here that I feel I feel is your destiny here. This could be a person or an idea or something of that nature, but um, I definitely feel like you need to um, focus more on whatever uh, whatever that is. And whoever that's for, I feel like you're going to know. So, um, anyways, Pisces, I know this reading was very scattered, and I'm sorry that it's a little late. I hope that you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up, comment, share, subscribe. Tap the bell icon if you'd like to receive notifications for when I upload new content. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great week.